Okay, Tan Hill. so I'm making this video specifically for you. Um, you asked me how to make a Minecraft video, and like I said, you'll be needing three things. You'll need video capturing software, um, voice recording, and video editing software, and of course, the place to upload it. So for the video capturing software, I use a program called Fraps. Um, you can use the free version, but it has a limit of 30 seconds to run, or you can get the full version for $37, and it's pretty simple to use. Um, I guess I can go into more detail if you'd like. I'll just give you a quick run, uh, run through. It can take pictures, it can do movies, and it can track FPS for any game that you're playing. Um, these are the options I use. It's easy for me to use all these options. I mean. Uh, standard, you should record in 30 FPS. That's what the human eye can see. Um, anything higher is just basically overkill. And you can do that, but it'll pretty much tax your computer. And unless you have a good enough graphics card, it won't do much for you. So, now that I've gone to the video capturing software, you'll also need voice recording software, which I use Mumble. And you can connect to any public channel that you have private access to. I use the WDZ clan channel to record my stuff. And uh, I'd recommend going into a private channel where nobody's around, like, for instance, this channel. And then just um, click the record button. Just make sure you have your uh, option set up quickly, like this. And that's probably some bad feedback, but whatever. And just go to recording. And it should give you an option like this. All I have to do is press start, type in a name, like, for instance, this is my movie. And then just start. And it will record and show up somewhere on the desktop, hopefully when everything is done. and it should be not here. I think my uh, program they're using to capture my desktop is interfering with my mumble so it's not capturing the audio because this is capturing the audio from me right now but whatever that's what should happen and uh, I made a few mistakes like trying to show you all that and what you need to use to edit those mistakes is a program such as Windows Movie Maker which is the free version of what you're probably going to use and it's pretty simple to use. Um, just click in here, and you can insert any footage that you might have that you've recorded, like say from your Fraps folder, and just insert anything you want to. And just edit it once from there. And once you're done editing it, you can easily just save project as. I don't know, my movie, that sounds about good, and just do save, but I'm not going to do that right now because that'll take a few minutes. And then after that, just upload it to YouTube by clicking this button, choose 720p, um, that sounds about right because 1080p is, as you can see, twice the size, and it's a pain to upload sometimes. But, if you say go to Pirate Bay, or do have the money to buy Adobe Premiere Pro, you can use this as well and it's much more intuitive a little bit more complicated to use but it is totally worth it you can do so much more with Premiere Pro than you can with most other video editing programs like this is a project that I have before and as you can see it's a little bit complicated with the timeline down here but it is much more worth it and I guess I can show you how to instruct you on this later on if you actually do buy it but for now, I'm just not going to get into this because it's just a whole nother tutorial. But really quickly, I'm going to try making a quick Minecraft video just for you. So, let me launch up Minecraft. Get into the WDZ server. And for default for Fraps, I have F9 as my capture key. So whenever I press F9, it should capture video for me. So, hey guys, 
I am making a tutorial for ten in them. And just junk like that. Now I'm going to press F9. And as you can see, it might be a little bit laggy because I'm doing a recording in a recording. But it shouldn't be that much laggier. At least I have a good graphics card, so I really don't need to worry about this type of stuff. So as you can see, I'm just doing a quick recording. La la la. And I'm done. So I press F9 again. Now I'm going to disconnect try and find my footage which is located in my fraps folder and here it is right there awesome so what I'm going to do is go to Windows Movie Maker I'm going to import that footage now, as you can see it's just panning through right now. This is the footage I have. And I'm going to do save movie. Um, well, actually, first, one of the things you should do is make sure it's widescreen, okay? Um, otherwise, you'll get some really weird pixel ratio on YouTube and you'll get these black bars. And you don't want those. You want widescreen. At least for most displays. Now, what you're going to do, you can publish your movie to YouTube, which is fairly simple and just type in your account and it should be done or if you don't have time to upload it right now you can save it for later and just save movie to your computer call it my movie or whatever and let's save it to the desktop and now we're done No. And as you can see, the movie is right here. It looks decent. What I'd recommend when you uh, do uh, record your movies in Minecraft, you should always make sure. Hold on. I forgot to show this to you. It's a really important thing. Whenever you do record your movies, make sure you go full screen and you minimize the taskbar like so. That'll make sure your pixel aspect ratio isn't affected and you'll get the best quality as possible. Okay? So make sure you do that. And you can upload uh, in real 720p. And that's all there is to it. If you have any more questions, just message me on Minecraft or whatever.